Good afternoon to our Denton ISD students, families, faculty, and staff. Uh, I come to you on this Friday in the, in the midst of school closure and in the midst of graduation season and senior activities and uh, Teacher of the Year celebration. So things I'm going to talk about just for a few minutes are number one, many of you may have heard by now that we've had to alter our graduation plans um, from the end of June at CH Con's Athletic Complex to um, the, our back to our original May dates. Uh, the sites have changed. Um, so we will be having our graduation at the Texas Motor Speedway um, in May. And if you'll look on our website, you'll see all the dates and times. But it is the original dates and times that we had uh, in the first place. A couple of reasons for that decision. First of all, um, we weren't really sure we were going to be able to have um, people in the stands at CH Collins and to have the graduates on the field. Um, we've been working with our local health officials about trying to make sure we, we have limited exposure um, so when that came to pass and we thought that we would have to consider having just the graduates and nobody in the stands, um, or maybe even have to cancel altogether if we get back on a stay-at-home order, we felt like it was um, a much better situation to go ahead and look for a different solution. So all the Denton County School Districts banded together and we're all going to have our graduations at Texas Motor Speedway. The same people that were looking to have graduation at Sage Collins have now moved it to TMS um, and our partnership with them has been fantastic. Um, what that will look like is um, our graduates will be seated, um, social distance apart. We've got their masks and things for them. Our parents will actually be able to come into the speedway and park in front of the big, big Hoss television screen so that we'll be able to, to see your graduates up, up close and your students up close. And we'll be able to proceed with our ceremony. Um, we will have masks that are going to be logoed with the class of 2020, according to each school. And when they come across to get their diploma, our intention at this time is for them to remove their masks, get a good professional picture taken by our team and by the folks that we pay. And then in addition to that, be able to, to be on the finish line or in, in victory, la victory lane um, for, for another uh, memorabilia picture uh, as, as a result of that. So we plan on making it very similar what happens at our graduations at UNT. We've just had to move it to Texas Motor Speedway and we're working through the details. So as we know more, we will share more. Next from that, we're going to have our recognitions for our Teachers of the Year um, coming, up in, coming up next week. And so we're looking forward to that. And many of you have probably heard from your campus about coming and getting student property from the school. So that process is also starting next week. So I know while graduation may be leading the minds of most of you, there's other things that are going on across the district. Um, just this past Wednesday, we served over 81,000 meals to our families um, in need and, and working through it. And I can't tell you how much I appreciate um, all of our families and, and all of our employees for all the work that they've done. And, and please know that, that we want to try to create an outstanding memory for our graduates as we have a graduation ceremony. Um, and we know that um, we're just as fluid as the information that comes to us. And, and we will try to make uh, and keep you informed and make the best decisions possible as information comes about. So thank you for your, for your patience with us, your flexibility. We're all in this together. Uh, we look forward towards creating an incredible event for our seniors and for our parents alike and giving our seniors one last chance to be together um, and get some closure to their, to their school career before they move on to the college, to military, or to the workforce. And parents, thank you for understanding. We appreciate you being our partner. And we look forward to a great graduation um, on our originally scheduled dates. And we will um, we'll go from there. So thanks, guys. Have a good day. Bye-bye.